Time to get the grub on. Grub time is over. Hey, there he is. Is that the same one? I think it is, actually. Alright, so... So you know that we currently own, uh, I own a Q60, and we're currently in Brian's BMW 550i X-Drive. Running red lights. Running red lights. Driving illegally. Great. So let's start with the cars that I've owned. Uh, real quick, just running through the game. Acura, 1990 Acura Integra, a 94 Subaru station wagon, I don't even know what the hell it was. Tucson Elisa, or Hyundai Tiburon. Honda Civic, Grand Prix, 1994. Pontiac Grand Prix, Acura TL, 2011 Honda Accord, and then a 2015 WRX. And now I've got the Q60. So, so my, my out of that list, least favorite car is probably the Subaru. It's a tie between like the Subaru and the uh, the, Grand, uh, the the Grand Prix. They both absolutely sucked. Uh, neither of them had heat or air. It's just absolutely awful. Favorite cars. You know, that first car always holds a sweet spot in my heart. So, you know, the Acura Integra was such a tunable car. I, I had done so much to that. Tried to get that as clean as possible. You know, I went total like Honda JDM, you know, style on that. So, uh, that holds a really soft spot in my heart. I love the 2015 WRX. Uh, the WRX was an awesome car to own. I got to tell you, though, like the 2015, the new body style I'm not that fond of. It's kind of why I ended up getting rid of it in the first place. But the car that I have now, the, the 2014 Q60 is, is awesome. I think that's an awesome car. It's an awesome drive. Looks amazing. Uh, stoked about that. So, I, you know, I, best of the best of those three that I just listed, probably, probably the Q60. Probably just because I, I have that right now. I don't know. Yeah. So. It's a nice car. Drives comfortable. Yeah. Quick. It's quick. It's fun to drive, nice to look at, a whole bit. No complaints. Good technology. Yeah. It, it hits all the check marks for me. How about you? Well, over the years, I've had 20 cars. I would say the earliest one I've had was a uh, 1969. Chevy C10. My first car was a 76 Mercedes Benz 240 diesel. But I've had German cars, American cars, um, anything from a Pontiac Grand Am to a uh, Audi S4 to Ram pickup trucks. To so you've had a wide range. Yes, I've had tons of different cars, all very appealing to me at the particular time that I got them. Um, there was a reason behind every one of them. Um, whether it be just a quick mode of transportation or just something that I always had my eye on for a long time. Um, I, you know, absolutely love German cars, BMWs, Volkswagens, Audis. Uh, I've had a handful of uh, each of them through the years. I definitely enjoy uh, this car. I would probably say as far as comfort, drivability, speed, the whole nine. Um, you know, I, I, I liked my uh, 89 325iS uh, BMW, my E30 that I had, that had the, uh, the e, uh, E36 M3 motor in it. Um, very, very quick, nimble, felt like you were driving a good car. Hmm. You know, I had that for, for a few years. A lot of times over the years, I just get rid of them quick or I had my Volkswagen Jetta, my 2004 GLI. I had that for uh, three years. And I think that's the longest I've ever had a car. Just three years? Just three years. That was it. Yeah. Honestly, 20, 20 cars over, you know, the course of 17 years, 18 years goes just pretty quick. So. Now that you mention it, I don't think I've ever really owned a car longer than three years either. Uh, 
No, no, I the Civic's the longest. Yeah, three years. Wow, that's actually kind of sad. Yes. Okay, it's driving kind of boatish right now. I don't know what the hell's going on. Need support? No. Maybe that's why. I can that So what was the so the BMW is one of your favorites. What was your least favorite car? Um, I would say the 99 Grand Am that I had because to me it was new. It was, I bought it in 2001. Mm -hmm. So it was only two years old. It was my first car I ever financed. Um, but it was, I got over it very shortly. It was just not very good. That's funny. Good looking. I, I had the same experience with the WRX now that, now that you mention it. It's a newer model, financed it, thought it was a new car at the time. Thought it was badass, and then after a while, you're like, "This is ugly. This sucks. I hate this. We can do better." Yeah. And you move on. And the the best, so obviously, was your your BMW, the 325 IS. Yeah, it's between. I would say this car, the two Beamers, mm -hmm. would be. Um, it would be this, the the F10 um, mm -hmm. 550i, and the. Uh, E30, the uh, 89 325 IS with the M3 motor in it. Yeah. So I would say that's my two favorite. My top, I would probably just have to say this. You know, I had a, a you know, I had a B7 and an, an 06 S4, Audi S4. That was a lot of fun. Um, you know, I oh, had. Yeah. Yeah. You you were in that a yep. couple of times. Yep. Six that's, speed leather exhaust. You know. Uh, yeah, I got to drive that one night. Oh, yeah. 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 So we'll leave our list of, of cars that we've owned in, in the description below. Yeah. Uh, so if you want to just kind of like take, take a glance at that and, and run through that, let us know what you guys have had over the over the course of a few years, what some of your favorites were and what your least favorites were. I'm always curious to see what other people are driving. So leave that stuff in the comment section below. Don't know what next week's subject is. So stay just, tuned. That's what you got to do. Do it. Later, bitch. See you.